After a week of startling primary losses, Hillary Clinton has fired her campaign manager, Patty Doyle. Well, actually, her exact words were, get off my husband, bitch. Mitt Romney has dropped out of the race for president, and now the only one standing in the way of McCain in the White House, this guy. Today, President Bush announced a new plan to help Americans who are in desperate need of food, housing, electricity, education, and medical care. The plan? Move to Iraq. Los Angeles was the site of the 50th annual Grammy Awards show, where Amy Winehouse nabbed five trophies, including the Grammy for Best New Skank. 89-year-old Mike Wallace is recovering from triple heart bypass surgery. Doctors say it was touch and go. Mr. Wallace lost two pints of dust. Maryland police say a 15-year-old Boy Scout has been charged with killing his parents and two younger brothers. Amazingly, he received a merit badge in killing your parents and two younger brothers. Scientists have learned that there is a link between diabetes and big breasts. Although scientists say there is one upside, they got to touch big breasts. 